<laughs> Good morning. It's 20 past three. Um, just got up and ready. Oh, even my camera struggling this morning. Um, to go to Gatwick. Because we're going to Italy to get married. Oh my god. Five days. Oh my god. How's she feel? Not too bad to be fair. Everyone keeps asking if we're nervous and not yet. Maybe when we get there. I don't know, we've not really got anything to be nervous about. No, I know, but it's just general. If the day is going to go well, that's generally what most people get. Well, I can't go about. back if we get married. Thanks. Uh, I feel be disgusting fine. because I feel like I need to brush my teeth, but. I really don't want to. Oh, I've got a toothbrush in there. No, I have mine in. No, I just don't want to do it now. Oh. I have mine in my um like handbag, so I might just do it at the airport maybe. Might do mine quickly. Hmm. But yeah. So anyway, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna head off to Gatwick. Oh, start. <laughs> So we have made it. It is half past 12 local time, half 11 back at home. So we did pay for a lake view because we thought this is a special occasion. We might as well pay the extra. So I'm just going to show you that and then I'm going to give you a little room tour. Oh my god. How good is that? Does this window actually open? Oh, it does, like fully as well. That's nice. You can kind of hang out. Jolly good. Oh, hello. It's taking a picture down there. So apologies to the air conditioning. It is rather loud. So I'm going to try and speak up but not shout. Um, so we've got a little bathroom through here. Toilet and bidet behind the door, which is good. Sink there. There's a lot of marble in this hotel. I don't know if it's real or what, but there's a lot of it. Nice big bath, little shower there, wardrobe, Joe's just hanging up his suit, we got our bed, which is twin, yeah I think it's a twin bed pushed together, and we've got this little cute little area, like a little vanity, again more marble, love it, love it, very aesthetically pleasing, TV, again another little cute desk, it's adorable. I love it. A little random sofa thing, so it's just where my dress is for now. I'm going to take that up to Kerry's in a minute. And yeah, there's the boy. Uh, you excited, babe? Yeah. So yeah, I am just going to text Kerry back um, and probably maybe get changed. I don't know. Excuse me, I'm trying to vlog. No, nothing. Do not do <laughs> Um, so yeah, I might even brush my teeth because I feel really like furry. Oh, how yeah, close? Random fact, wait, how close is that to the name? Sacchetto. Come on, it's got most of the letters in there. How do you expect them to be cold now? Because we've got them in the fridge. No. What? How do you expect grapes to be cold now? Because we always put them in the fridge. Oh, are they not? They look fresh. Oh, they got pips in it over here, haven't they? Yeah. This is my nice. Oh, that's 
Damn, my bags be telling you no lies. I definitely have not had a nap today, and I didn't sleep on the plane either. So, anyway, it's quarter. What? Oh no, it's quarter past five. I forget. This is different language, Dan. Oh, that was clever, wasn't it? Um, but we are just waiting to hear back from Kerry. Um, we're gonna go for a little kind of walk. Sorry, oh, fine with these nails. I get to tickle that bit up my nose and. Very satisfying. Anyway, um, yeah, there's a shop that sells this moisturiser that me and Joe like, so we're gonna try and pop there and grab that. And I need another Kiko mascara, um, and there's a Kiko like around the corner from here. So I don't know if it's still open, so I need to Google that in a second. But yeah, that's the plan. And we're gonna get us some dinner. Um, although dinner doesn't start until seven, and like I said, it's only quarter past five, so. Oh, I didn't tell you. Um, randomly, we got, like, with compliments from the hotel, a bottle of, um, what was it, dry white wine, and that was covered in fruit, which is now in the fridge because I do not want to waste said fruit. So it's in our hubby and wifey mugs. How apt. But yeah, I thought that was so cute. I did put on the, um, like, Tui special request thing that it was a honeymoon because you can't like write in or as far as I know you couldn't write in that like it was a wedding and stuff. I did email ahead like I emailed the guy at the hotel and I just said look we're flying out on Wednesday we get married on the Monday is there kind of anything you can do um, and he just said he'll see what he can do. Um, I don't know if it is that or whether that's the to be request thing. I don't know but anyway we shall see on Monday whether we come back to rose petals or god knows what but yeah i'm quite excited now need some dinner lots of food are you hungry yeah, yeah. pizza yes. right let's go oh oh he pointed the stairs uh -oh. Oh. oh be careful <laughs> Hi, Ducky Ducky. afternoon oh no that is another spot oh one coming there one coming up here that one's playing up again mm, so annoying but it's 10 to 4 i haven't vlogged anything really today i'm actually starting fantastic um i haven't really vlogged anything today one because i've been here before and i have vlogged here before like i've done a holiday vlog um before obviously i've had new subscribers since then and all of that stuff but i figure we're going to the same places i don't want to double up on things like i've already kind of showed you and spoken about and all of that kind of stuff and i also don't want it to be random intervals like this that i'm talking like basically time stamping it um and saying what we're going to go and do and then like i say then just showing you stuff we've already done before so yeah i'm not really sure how this proper vlog's gonna go like i say i'm gonna try and film the wedding kind of thing like a maybe a chatty bit in the morning like how i'm feeling stuff like that getting ready and whatever and then kind of bits throughout the day just for a memory so 
sorry my camera cut me off probably at a good time to be fair but yeah so that's how I'm feeling so I'm not sure how the rest of this kind of video is gonna go but I'm kind of just uh I need to stop doing that and I've realized I do that a lot I'm gonna kind of I don't know why I say that but I'm going to <laughs> finish this kind of segment in just what I was saying obviously like I say I was just time stamping it's 10 to 4 we're gonna head off back out just gonna go for a little mooch gonna go up to co-op really random but it's a good little bless you <laughs> gonna go for a little walk and stuff get a couple more steps in because we've done quite well I've done just under 5,000 uh, 5,000 15,000 today um so I'm gonna get that up a little bit more and then we're gonna come back and get ready bless you before we go to dinner, hence why I still only look like this. Because it has like one foot and one its beak on the other. I think it's done. Oh, just pick it. Sorry, Kerry. It didn't go as far as I wanted it to. <laughs> oh, no, it's two. Oh, no, he's run away with it. Every time. Right. Good morning. You just distract me all the time and not in a good way. Good morning. It's quarter past 10 and we are on a ferry over to our wedding destination, which sounds really scary. And it's really scary actually thinking that it's in three days time. And that is why we are going over there because we've got to sign some paperwork and do all that kind of fun stuff and we're having the hair and makeup trial done. And I thought I would show you the before, but I figure I have already showed you the before a lot of times before and in the makeup trial for the wedding reception. Um, hopefully the, the makeup is going to go a lot better this time and obviously I've got a proper day to test it as well in like the heat and stuff. Don't know what the weather's going to be like on Monday. I think it's still meant to be nice, so hopefully it will last well today and then I'll have a good indication of how well it's going to last on Monday. So yeah, anyway, I'm going to see Dad all and I'll probably show you when I've actually had it done. So, I am not only just coming on to show you hair and makeup, this is my hair and makeup that I have done myself. They only did half my face and all of my hair, but just not as tight as it's going to be on the day. Um, but then they took it all off because they don't want Joe to see it. So I couldn't even show you either. But anyway, it is, I don't know, it's quarter to 11 now. Me and Joe are just come on to walk because I'm under 10,000 steps and I'm not going to bed under 10,000. Um, so yeah just having a little wander around the little town and then we're gonna head back up go to bed and have a bit of a lay in tomorrow because i'm not gonna lie the last few days are kind of catching up on me a little bit i'm sorry i couldn't show you anything um in terms of my hair and makeup we had a really good day we got to like explore the wedding venue our kind of like reception venue like where we're gonna have a meal and stuff and our like pre-drinks and all of that kind of fun stuff um, yeah, so it was really nice to kind of catch up and everyone else gets here tomorrow, which is awesome Yeah, hopefully we'll do some exciting things over the weekend and I don't know how much more I'll vlog like next week because I'm gonna be someone's wife, so I'm gonna be a bit busy That's <coughs> uh, really wrong. This lighting though is not, it's not cute. It's so yeah we're gonna go <laughs> finish off these steps and head back up. And we'll Why are you so low down? Because I'm like really low. Oh, you, are you, oh, okay. Perched. So yeah, we'll catch you tomorrow. Maybe. Maybe. Bye. Bye. Oh my god. Come on, speed in them. Okay. Good morning. That was actually a really nice fade in. Unintentional. I think it's almost eight o'clock. Uh, we've been up for maybe 20 minutes. Just been laying her because we get married tomorrow. Just saying. Just saying. And yeah, I just wanted to just kind of have this moment. Yeah, I thought 
I might try and turn the end of this kind of vlog into a like almost diary, like video diary type thing of like how I'm feeling and all like the run up to everything. Like, cause up till now, neither of us have kind of felt that it's really happening. Like we thought, okay, maybe when we fly out here, no, not really. Maybe when everyone else got here yesterday, maybe a little bit, but um, I think it might hit tonight, but yeah, I don't know. Um, but yeah, anyway, I think we're just gonna lay here for a, another 10 minutes or so. We're gonna get ready and see what everyone else is doing. And yeah, I woke up yesterday with a fucking cold. Are you fucking kidding me? Two days before I get married. <laughs> fucking immune system is so shit. But yeah, luckily it's not like a snotty nose kind of cold. It's literally all in my chest, but it keeps making me cough all the time. And I'm <clears throat> trying not to do it so hard. And I know tomorrow I'm gonna be sat there and he's gonna like ask me something and I'm just, <coughs> just like have some coughing fit or something. Um, my mum also like started to come down with a cold yesterday as well, which is fantastic. So we're the Neverwells are gonna be at the wedding. Fab. Anyway, I'm gonna see what everyone else is doing. And stroke my cat. <laughs> and catch you in a bizzle. <laughs> P.S. I didn't want to take my eye makeup off last night, but I did take my face makeup off. Me too. Well done. Good afternoon. So it is, oh shit, quarter to four. Um, I thought I'd give you an update. I've just updated on Instagram, but obviously I figure not everyone who follows me on Instagram watching my vlogs and vice versa. So I might as well double up on content. Um, sorry if you have already seen this. I just had a little photo session with a wedding girl. I had Joe's brother take some photos of my dress which is really nice of him. Um, so yeah, I'm feeling bleh still. I've just got like a lem sip in my wifey mug, premature, I know, but what can you do? Um, so yeah, I'm hoping this will kind of kickstart everything and help my immune system a bit. And yeah, so I'm just waiting for Joe to get back. I don't know where he's gone. I just texted him to say, where are you? But yeah, I need to have a bath and have, sh um, hair wash, uh, scrub, shave, fucking everything <laughs> tonight. But I'm probably gonna go out, I might go out with Kerry in a minute and we might go to the Kiko that's down the road and get like a foot mask thing to do tonight, I'm not sure. And yeah, I don't know. I need to pack a bag to take over to Kerry's because I'm staying over there tonight. Um, but yeah, I really don't know where he's gone. I'm like, what the fuck? I'm just literally sat here on my own and I don't really know what to do. Like I don't have the key, so if I leave, I can't get back in. Um, so, yeah, anyway, it hasn't really hit me yet, like, even when people just saw my dress a minute ago, it's like, still not really hit me. I think it's because I'm so spaced out, and yeah, so I feel like maybe tonight, after we go for drinks, we're gonna try and go for like a lads and ladies night kind of thing, like all the girls go to one bar and the guys go to another, so I think that'd be really nice to kind of, I don't know, get to know each other a bit more, and just generally have a couple of drinks and a nice evening um so yeah that's the plan for now i'm just kind of mooching drunk on my lumps up and yeah just chilling out being a single lady um yeah it's the last night of being miss penton um but yeah my last night as a technically single lady like when i tick a form now I have to change what box I tick. Where's the boy? I don't know where the boy is. Oh my god, I found a cat today as well. Didn't film any of it because it was there and I thought it was going to run away. So I took some pictures. So again, if I can, I'll insert them now. Yes, selfies with a cat because it was gorgeous and it was the only cat I've seen in this whole fucking trip. And there's been about 10,000 million dogs. 
and I'm just not a dog person. I am so a cat person, so I was so happy when I saw it. And it's like a shop cat, and I know what shop it's in. So I might go back there later, <laughs> if it's still open. Um, but yeah, anyway, I'm gonna love you and leave you for now. Um, and yeah, I will catch you maybe a little bit later today. Good evening. It's half past 11. How did that happen? We were meant to just go for like a little kind of drink all the girls together and all the guys together, which we did. We didn't end up meeting until like 25 par, or 25 to nine, was it? Yes. Yeah, around nine. And I was like, fuck. So yeah, had a drink, just had one each, because I didn't want to go overboard, I didn't want to feel like shit tomorrow. I already feel like fucking shit enough as it is. Um, more so because everybody bloody smokes over here and it's just not good for my lungs when I feel normal let alone when I feel like this. So yeah, I'm just finishing another couple of empty. Hell yeah, my well the mug. Um, yeah, just got ready for bed. Got my bride PJs on. Oh yeah. Oh no, what does it say? Bride to be. Yeah. Got all my stuff ready for tomorrow because we are going for breakfast, normal time, eight o'clock. Oh, eight-ish. Gonna have a shower and stuff first. Go to breakfast and then get in a taxi at nine. Probably gonna be with that a bit early, but we need to drop off stuff at my dad's and then walk to the hairdressers and get all our hair and stuff done. Had my trial done on Friday. Really liked what she done, kind of similar to what I had the last one. So if you haven't already seen that, I'll try and remember to leave a link down below. I probably won't though. It is in the title of the vlog though, my hair and makeup trial. Um, but yeah, I think I'm gonna go for something different. Hopefully you'll see it tomorrow. Um, me and Kerry are thinking of going for like the same thing, but because we got like kind of two different color hairs, I think it would look like really nice with a picture from behind. And we're going to get changed at my dad's, so I'm going to get him to take some pictures and stuff. Um, I'm going to finish this drink, have a couple of Pringles because, you know, um, and then try, try very hard to get some sleep because I'm sure the makeup artist has very good concealer, but you know these under eye bags they're just not going anywhere um so yeah i'll catch you on my fucking wedding day holy shit it still has not sunk in yet i mean i know it's happening but it's just fuck